But capitalism sucks. <laughs> I don't know. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> it is about uh, being a slave to capitalism, to put it lightly. <laughs> Literally, it's um. Let me let me just refer to the lyrics. Gosh. Right, so line up in a crossfire. This, this, so I used to work in a coffee shop that will remain anonymous, but recently made the headlines for being a terrible coffee shop. <laughs> it was basically just like um, watching the queue that would arrive at seven o'clock every morning, and how depressing it was. Um, and it really, it really got to me. I mean, besides the fact that I was also there at seven in the morning working. Our entire society is literally just consumerist and constantly building up these walls of like of uh, of just materialistic objects that we don't need. And it's like it's the whole mindless going to work every day, but also this feeling that we need to go to work every day. Musically, it does. It almost represents that as well. So the majority of the song is very much it's the same thing repeated. We had little yeah. things here and there, just so it isn't boring to listen to. But it's like it has that monotonous sort of lulling, just walking through the song yeah. as it goes until you get to the end. To this, like I don't want to put into the numbers. Like I don't want to be part of that. Yeah. And that's when it sort of goes nuts and breaks out of what it was originally. When it's really fun live as well because I get to like is. hit my guitar really hard and scream down a microphone. <laughs> and, uh, it's also, very cathartic after the rest of the song. I also really enjoyed writing this. I, I feel like before I wrote this, I hadn't written anything on guitar in a long time, um, and like my, the whole the whole way I'd ever really written was just me and a guitar in my bedroom, kind of like singing out my diary. Um, and I hadn't done that in ages, so when I came to this song, I, I don't know how I felt, uh, but it felt like I was, it felt more homely, like like natural, because I had my guitar back with me and, and it, the lyrics therefore came out a lot more naturally. And I suppose that's probably why they're a bit more cryptic, because they're less stylized, I want to say. But also, when I was writing this, I was writing it at, ho at my home home where I grew up um, in the living room and my dad came home from work. <laughs> Bless him. My dad's so supportive of of the band. Every time we do a show he goes, oh you were marvellous darling, specifically to Sam. But hey, without he, fail. Without fail. But he came in from work, ironically, after what must have been another monotonous day perhaps. Um, he just sat down on the sofa and was like, can you do that upstairs please? <laughs>